Water-sensitive urban design, or WUSUD, is a vital part of building our urban environments. As our urban centres grow, we tend to build more infrastructure, larger pavements, better roads, buildings get bigger, and our green spaces sometimes get smaller. What was once a house and a backyard with a tree is now a block of flats. Losing this green space has many negative effects on our health and our local area. Council is trying to help restore the balance by bringing green spaces back to our footpaths and streets. Our designs can work in many ways to be more aesthetic, to filter pollutants entering our waterways, making our streets cooler and increasing our permeable areas. It might not look like much, but these projects play an important part of our growing urban areas. Some of them are as simple as incorporating gardens with low water demanding plants to replace concrete or paving. Other more complex systems involve using plants as biofiltration units to filter and remove pollutants and litter entering our waterways. The plants trap silt and litter on the top layer, then the roots and specialty soils below the ground filter out fine and soluble pollutants, breaking them down for use in plant growth. Below all of this is a drainage layer that drains away the filtered stormwater before it travels to our creeks, harbours and ocean. These gardens target pollution at the source and improve the aesthetics of our urbanised areas, making them a valuable part of our landscape design. Willoughby City Council are constructing many targeted wusud throughout our council area and incorporating them into our local centre urban design. These projects are being built to make our community a better place to live, working with urban growth while retaining the benefits nature can bring to our urban environments.